Gail is saying chemicals in plastic change the way boys play. So apparently there are chemicals used in plastics are feminising the brains of baby boys. And it's plastics in... Plastics in things, uh, things that are used to soften plastics in household items like uh, plastic furniture, shoes, PVC flooring and shower curtains. Um, and the yes. stuff that food comes in as well. Yeah, yeah exactly. So it's affecting uh, the, the baby's growth in the... Uh, Sperm too, counts in yeah, men. Too I know much it's one of estrogen, things. I suppose. But so it's saying that boys have... Um, and are less wanting to play with cars and guns and diggers, but more feminising the way they want to play. I mean, I was thinking about this this morning. I was thinking, what? Well, just suppose uh, this is 100% the case. Uh, what could you possibly do about it? The chances is probably nothing. I mean, there's plastics in paint, aren't they? There, yeah. and there's polymers in paint. I mean, it's everywhere. Yeah, it's saying luggage, traffic cones, boys, you know, everywhere. Traffic cones. No, mind you, See, Eric, it's all starting to make sense. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone alarmed? The population, alarmed? Oh, the population is still going up, though, isn't it? Yeah, but that's because that's of the immigrants. They come over here, here <laughs> they take our jobs, they fill up our hospitals. And we feed them plastic. <laughs> <laughs> <We> feed... <laughs> um, OK, well, that's uh, one uh, horror story from the Daily Mail.